You're watching Let the Quran Speak. Now we answer questions we receive from you, our viewers. If you have a question, please visit our website, www.quranspeaks.com. Okay, Brother Shabir, this question is, when I enter the workforce, are certain jobs haram or prohibited? And this person mentions nursing. So they're, well, they're to say, you know, you might have to look at the opposite gender, physically touch them, that sort of thing. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, okay, let's think about the general idea first about certain jobs being prohibited or not, and then we talk about nursing specifically. Mm -hmm. As for jobs in general, e yes, certain things are prohibited. We can't get into gambling, for example. We can't uh, be part, uh, like a substantial part of an industry that uh, does uh, evil things. We, we can't contribute to, let's say, alcoholism, for example, mm -hmm. in the nation. Um, if we, we are pr producing weapons of mass destruction that you know will be used for evil purposes, obviously all of this is uh, impermissible, haram for a, a Muslim. Uh, and of course certain uh, evil things that are widely recognized across the board, like prostitution for example, would be prohibited uh, for, a, for a person of our faith. Now what about the specific of nursing? Here the questioner is asking if I get into nursing then I may have to touch the opposite gender and so on. Well, uh, all of this is within the realm of possibilities, of permissibility, because the, in the Islamic tradition it is recognized that necessities override the prohibition. So normally it is prohibited to like see the private part of the opposite gender uh, or even the private part of another adult person. Uh, but uh, in, uh, when one needs to treat that part, uh, a doctor or a nurse is uh, uh, licensed uh, within the religious principles uh, to, to view the part that's ne necessary for the treatment. And, and so the necessity overrides the prohibitions. Mm -hmm. What about something like banking, like being involved in the banking industry? Would that be considered prohibited? Well, the, the one item in the banking industry that is quite problematic for Muslims is the receiving of interest. And uh, so receiving of interest is absolutely prohibited. Because of this, uh, Muslims have uh, distanced themselves from anything to do with interest, whether uh, witnessing a contract, writing the contract, or, or even uh, getting into a loan tr uh, transaction that will require one to pay interest. Um, uh, so the, uh, within the banking industry, this is uh, very much uh, ubiquitous. So if, if one gets into this industry, one would want to uh, avoid that as much as possible. But the one thing that is absolutely haram or prohibited that must be avoided uh, at all costs is the uh, receiving of interest. So a Muslim would not be allowed to receive uh, interest in, in any such transaction. All right, that's all the time we have, Brother Shabir. You're welcome. And we'd like you to visit our website, www.quranspeaks.com, and check out our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash Quranspeaks. As always, please continue to write to us your comments and questions help guide the show. I'm Sophia Ali. For all of us here at Let the Quran Speak, thank you for watching. I'll see you next week.